In this video, we are going to present the 20 most common aircraft ground support equipment or simply GSE used at airports. We will introduce each type of equipment and shortly discuss its function. The first is the aircraft towing tractor. It is also known as pushback tractor, pushback tug and aircraft tug. It is a heavy duty vehicle used for towing an aircraft when aircraft's engines are off. An aircraft ground power unit is a ground support equipment that supplies electrical power to the aircraft on the ramp when the aircraft engines are off. A preconditioned air unit is a ground support equipment that supplies air conditioning to the aircraft on the ramp when its own air conditioning is off. In summers, it provides cooling and in winters, it provides heating. A jet bridge, also known by many other names such as a passenger boarding bridge, jetway, jetty, and avio bridge, is the largest ground support equipment on the ramp. It is a movable tunnel structure that makes a bridge connection between the aircraft and the passengers. A belt loader is a mobile conveyor belt used for loading passenger luggage in narrow-body aircrafts. An associated non-motorized piece of equipment with the belt loader is baggage cart that is simply a cart on wheels for storing luggage. The baggage cart is towed by a towing tractor. This is not the same as the pushback tractor, but it's a smaller version. It is a commonly used vehicle on the ramp for towing other ground support equipment. A cargo loader is a heavy duty ground support equipment used for loading cargo on wide body aircrafts. A unit load device, or simply ULD, is a standardized container used for packaging cargo efficiently for easy transport and storage inside the aircraft's cargo compartment. Unit load devices are transported over what's called a cargo dolly, which is a non-motorized piece of ground support equipment and is towed by a towing tractor. The ground support equipment responsible for aircraft refueling is the fuel hydrant dispenser. It is a fuel rig mounted over a truck chassis that filters and samples aviation fuel before letting it through to the aircraft. Alternatively, a refuel truck is another ground support equipment for aircraft refueling. It is a large oil tanker carrying aviation fuel and associated pumping system for uplifting the fuel into the aircraft. An airport catering truck is another important ground support equipment. It is a truck with height adjustable container that stores flight catering supplies. It brings catering supplies from flight kitchen and loads it up on the aircraft. A ground support equipment similar in design to an aircraft catering truck is an ambulifter, a short form of ambulance and lifter. It is used for transporting wheelchair passengers, stretcher passengers, or any other physically challenged passengers into the aircraft. A lavatory service truck is the ground support equipment responsible for draining aircraft waste tank after each flight. It has a waste tank and a disinfectant fluid tank assembled over a truck chassis. Alternatively, it could be lavatory service cart to be towed to the ramp by a towing tractor. A potable water truck is another simple ground support equipment used for replenishing potable water in the aircraft after each flight. A de-icing truck is an important ground support equipment used for spraying de-icing and anti-icing fluids over aircrafts operating at extremely cold airports. The ground support equipment that generally operates at the very end of the ramp operations is an air start unit 
or simply an ASU. It is a high-pressure air compressor used for pneumatically gig-starting an aircraft jet engine. Lastly, some small accessories such as safety cones and wheel chocks are also categorized as ground support equipment owing to the important support function they perform in ramp operations. That is it from our side. If you would like to learn more about these equipment and their operations, please check the link in the description below for a comprehensive ground support equipment course that explains the basics of aircraft ground handling operations performed on the ramp with emphasis on the different types of equipment used. Don't forget to like and subscribe and do tell us in the comments section if you found this video helpful.